welcome back to my channel. My name is Michelle. I am a full-time reseller on Poshmark and eBay. Um, my username is MCWare for you. If you want to check out my closet, been selling on eBay since 1999, um, and Posh since 2016. <laughs> okay, it's early. Bear with me. All right, so today I have a haul. It's mostly men's. I ran into uh, our local Goodwill a few days ago, and I just left out with a whole bunch of men's finds. So I'm just going to jump right into it and show you, okay? So basically, Kuji was the steal of the show. This is a 4X men's Kuji Royale. I'm not sure if they still make these. Kind of like the Sailor Captain type vibes. And it's just a white polo with gold stripes. It looks quite nice. I do need to wash these before I list them though, just to brighten up them because they are white. Oh no, that was, yeah, they still, I'm still gonna wash them. So that was 4X. And then I found this button up and this one is NC size 6X. Yeah. And this is a new to me brand, actually. This is how you, I think it's pronounced NC. Correct me if I'm wrong. Little patches, again, like sailor vibes, or I don't know. I'm not sure what vibe, <laughs> but it's really cool. I really like it, kind of blinged out. And again, this is a button up. This is size 6X. And they need to go get washed. All right, I did find one lady's Miss Me jeans, and these are size 28, the mid-rise easy boot cut. And Miss Me still sells for me, not too much, because they do retail, I think, for just under $200 new. But they are like a low-rise style. You could tell usually by the zipper. The zipper's like only four inches. And they are size 28. They're known for their blinged out pockets. And yeah, they're in really good, good shape. All right, and next we have some Kuji men's jeans. Pretty sure obviously the same person donated and they are, they're really cool looking. Look at those back pockets. Woo, yes. And right down to the zipper, big long zipper. And did I see the size? These are size 42.35, so for, a tall guy. Um, they look like, to me, they look like they haven't been worn. Yeah, they're really, really nice looking. Just uh, so much detail. This is embroidered down by the leg. And uh, these really, really cool patches. So those, and it doesn't stop there. I found Crown Hofter, Crown Hofter. New to me brand again, but I think the same person. Really, really out there and cool. Look at those bad boys. Gold, red patches. Oh my goodness, these are amazing. And they are a size 44 man. And no inseam, 100% cotton. Yeah, they don't say anything about an inseam. And they are button fly, button fly. And again, they feel new, they look new, and they probably belong to that same person. All right, next we have a pair of Carhartt, and they're the flannel-lined Carhartt. And these are a size 3830, 3830, and your traditional Carhartt pa uh, patch. Very sturdy jeans. These are, um, I think they're workman jeans. So like if you're working outside, Although they are flannel, so they would be hot, but in the winter time. And again, they feel great. They still have their crease in them, so I can't imagine they were worn too much. All right, next we have US Polo Ralph Lauren jeans. Again, men's. And they are the cargo style. And they are a size. 42 34 long so again this person's taller on the taller side great great jeans weighty and no flaws 
All right, next jeans are, whoops. I can't even, I don't know, I'm just gonna show you. I can't even, I can't even pronounce it because of the embroidery. <laughs> So I don't want to like just be staring at it. Let you do that. So stare at it. Not really sure of this brand, but I'll run it through Google Imaging. When I'm not sure of a brand, I'll run it through Google Imaging and it will tell me. And they are 46 waist and a 33 inch length. Attitude maybe off the something. I don't know. Again, there it is. And the back. And I'm pretty sure, again, they belong to the same person. Again, they don't look like they were worn. Dark blue, navy wash. And, yeah, 46.33. Okay. And then we have a South Pole. Anybody remember South Pole back in the day? These are the only ones that, to me, look a little faded. And, yeah, they, they feel, I think they were just probably worn the most. Unless that's the uh unless they're unless they're new and they sell them already pre-faded which sometimes they're size 46 stretch by south pole and they they very do they do stretch they very very do stretch like they say 46 but i'm going to say an extra two inches they stretch when i say faded see right there that's like where you sit so i don't know if anybody knows let me know the inner looks fine though no fade and then that same fade is like where these pockets are. And this is the front. Okay. And those are the South Pole. All right. And then first time finding men's American Eagle, probably just bread and butter. Look maybe new without tags. Men's American Eagle. And they are a size 4832. 4832 American Eagle men's and they are the original straight it says right there original straight regular zipper not button fly and there we have those Woo, lots of jeans all right last pair of jeans are another pair of NC brand goods I think I had one other pair and this is what they're logo and patch looks like and they are a size 44 44 they're not as crazy as far as um but the seams again either they were recently dry cleaned or they're almost new because they do still have the seams down the legs Ooh. yeah right there very nice looking jeans and this is the back, po back pocket okay wow that was a lot of jeans okay and now I have four pairs of shoes like new dance go and what size are you size 37 which is like they're six and a half six to six and a half like new and these retail they're oil leather they retail for over a hundred I saw them for about 40. Uh, nurses, anyone in the medical, people that are on their feet for a long time. Again, this was thrifting, $5. They ended up at the thrift store. And I found two pairs. And these are also a size 37. Look at the bottoms. Zero heel dra drag. No toe, nothing like, I'm not convinced these were even worn. <laughs> So again, size 37, one in brown and one in black, and they are the oiled leather. Okay, next is a new to me brand, Eric Michael, made in Portugal. Let's see, Eric Michael, made in Portugal. Uh, very gently worn, and these were also a size 37, which again, size six to six and a half. Very, very soft, buttery leather on these ones. Very soft. And this is a new to me brand, so I need to pull comps on them. And when I say pull comps, I check on recently sold on eBay. And um, then I kind of figure out, these are like a gray color, gray as well. Then, um, so I look on eBay recently sold with each thing and then I determine how much things should be priced. 
So the only time you could like kind of set your own price is if there are not many or none of an item that you're looking for recently sold um, and yours is the only one on the platform, then, you know, you could set the supply and demand just like any other, any other place. So yes, those are so cute. All right. Last ones are these Torrid Lavender. And I thought these, I thought I was gonna, <laughs> thought I was gonna keep these. They are a size nine wide or so they say, cause I'm a 10 and a half, 11. And these were clearly one to two sizes bigger than what I wear. Like I, I couldn't, I had so much room still when I tried them on. So I'm gonna have to put that in the description because if someone were a size nine wide, these will not fit them. These would not fit them. If, they, if they're too big for me at a size 10 and a half, 11, these wouldn't fit them. But again, beautiful, beautiful color. Just picture that with a nice white petty or even this color, lavender petty. And have they been worn? Doesn't look like it, maybe once, twice. And um, yeah. They just ended up there. All right, last thing uh, I found is one bra. Victoria's Secret, again, if you know, you know, Victoria's Secret bras are still very popular. And this is a 38D. And they reach out the mall for $50 to $60. That was the last time I checked two years ago. They could be more now. And this one is, this obviously is new without tags. Feels new, looks new, and it has this little paper thing, which I imagine would would have fallen off if it was um, washed. So I will not wash it. I will, I will sell it new with uh, without tags, and it is I said that already. Thirty eight D, and it it says t shirt lightly lined full coverage, and when you are listing bras, you 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 want to put it would it would say Victoria's Secret, um, lightly lined full coverage. Black bra size, I said 38D, I hope. <laughs> Did I say 38D? 38D. So that's what I would put for the um, the title. You wanna always make sure you don't wanna just put bra or 38D. You wanna actually put what kind of bra it is, the brand, the size, the color, and lots of times you wanna put underwire because lots of times in the pictures, people, um, you just can't tell whether it's underwire or not, so I always like to put that. So there you have it, that was my haul. I appreciate it if you've stuck with me. Uh, please comment, like, share, whatever. <laughs> I appreciate it so much. Thanks for watching and have a nice day. Bye-bye.